How did you feel when you found out that Junior was a snitch? Um, well, I didn't believe it for the first three weeks, although my father told me every... The, the way I found out was he left a letter saying goodbye, but he didn't say that he was a tattletale. He just said that he was going into prison. He didn't want to tell me that he was getting more time than he told me, blah, blah, blah. Um, so for the first three weeks that everyone just automatically knew it was him because of the way that my father was arrested, I still did not believe it. Right. So um, he was calling me, and at the third week, he finally confessed and said, yeah, I did do it. So um, as a, a, a loyal wife, and a mother, I did take his word, because that's what I believe that you do when you marry. Yeah. Um, but after he did tell me that he cooperated, all ties were cut. After the snitching stuff happened, suddenly the house, we, we find out the house. My house was robbed. My, yeah. it's actually, it happened twice, but um, the last time they, they were actually, they were in my bedroom. They ripped mm. up pictures of my family, my father. They ripped my Bible up. They, like, sliced the couch. They, they, it, was such an, it was such a personal attack yeah. that... Um, I felt I felt threatened in a, in a different kind of way. Not like, oh my God, someone's going to come in and kill me. I was more afraid of him and him being behind bars than I would be of the stranger still. But right. it was just a violation, especially for me. I'm very close to God. Right. Very, very serious when it comes to that. So to touch my Bible, it was pretty much like I had to leave that house.